Hey everyone, my name is Yusuf and I'm a medical student studying at Oxford University and I'm also the director of the Aspiring Medic. So in this video, we'll be speaking to medical students from across the UK on why they decided to go into medicine. If you guys are new here, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I've always been really interested in applying to medicine because when I was much younger, both of my grandparents passed away because of cancer. And although I was too young to fully understand the diagnosis, I think as kids, we pick up on things. And I really picked up on the fact that when the doctors spoke to my parents, they really helped calm them down and they made the entire situation so much more bearable for my parents. And although they couldn't help out my grandparents medically, I think they definitely helped my parents and our entire family emotionally. And seeing what a great impact a doctor can have on people just amazed me and I decided that that is something that I want to do for the rest of my life make an impact on people help them out you know not just medically but also emotionally and I just think it's so extremely fulfilling and that's why I decided to study medicine. The diversity in terms of diseases was also something that I was able to see during my work experience now this was hospital in-person work experience where I was able to have a look at a huge variety of different specialties including respiratory, gynaecology, uh, trauma and orthopaedics and all of those not to mention GP, radiology, all of those allowed me to see the different sorts of diseases that each of those specialties see and you're able to see a huge huge range on a day-to-day -day basis and of course if you're looking at GP or A&E you're going to see even more and seeing all these different diseases and potentially how a patient can have comorbidity so combinations of those diseases was something that really sparked my interest and in see actually you know what each patient is going to be so different and it's so complex and being able to make an impact in that way and helping them potentially when they're at their most vulnerable is something that I found incredibly fulfilling and still drives me today. Hi my name is William I'm a uh, fifth year medical student at Imperial College London. I guess when someone asks me why medicine the thing that really jumps to my mind is the emotional satisfaction and sort of reward that you get from it as a career as a vocation. When you discuss it with um, with people who don't do medicine, they they tend to lean towards all the reasons why you shouldn't do medicine uh, in terms of not being reimbursed quite as well. But I think the emotional satisfaction and reward that you get from it as a career uh, almost makes up for that. Um, it's a different kind of reward, if you see what I mean. And I think just the way you get to make such a big impact on someone's life uh, multiple times every day as a doctor, it's something that can... Um, it's certainly different to the tangible rewards uh, in being paid, but um, I think it's definitely something that is, um, it, it more than makes up for it. So for me, the main reason to go into medicine was because of the diversity, and that was twofold. One, in terms of the diversity in terms of patients you're seeing, but also diversity in terms of the diseases. So if we start off with patients, you're going to see patients from all walks of life, regardless of race, ethnicity, class, age. It's a huge, huge spectrum within that. And that in itself is quite grounding, and it means that each day is so, so different. The personalities that you're interacting with will be completely different, not only within the patients that you're seeing, but also with the teammates, other doctors, nurses, healthcare assistants, pharmacists, physiotherapists, the whole allied healthcare professional team. Everything's going to be so different and each patient may require a different solution, whether it be in terms of conservative treatment, surgery, preventative methods. And again, that's all tailored to the patient, whether it be themselves as a whole, but also thinking about their genetics as well. And personally, any personalised medicine is something that's becoming increasingly used as well. Hi, I'm Thurishan and I'm a fourth year medical student at the University of Oxford. And one of the reasons I chose to study medicine because medicine gives me an opportunity for lifelong learning and the ability to grow throughout my career. Medicine is a really complex field and as medical professionals we need to know how the human body works, what goes wrong in the human body, and how to fix it. But besides learning all of this from our teachers and textbooks, we need to connect that knowledge to what a patient experiences in daily life. Um, and being able to do that is very difficult. It takes a long time to learn and it takes a longer time to master. But it's because of this complexity that I see medicine almost as a craft. And you can get better at your craft over time. 
Uh, you never stop learning in this field from your first day of medical school to your last day as your, as your, from your time as a consultant. And you always have the opportunity to learn more skills and gain different ideas on patient care. And you always have a good benchmark of how you're doing and how you're improving because you're never going to stop taking care of patients and you never stop reflecting on how you can do better for your patients. It's almost like medicine is mental weightlifting. As you go to the gym and you put in the work and the, wet, the numbers on those weights keep going up, it's the same thing in medicine. You show up, you learn, and your patient care will get better over time. And I'm very grateful that I've chosen a career where I can continue to, to learn and work on my craft um, and get better in a way that truly makes a difference for others. One of the reasons why I decided to join medicine was because of the community-based care that is provided by doctors. Personally, the way that I've experienced medicine was very much like a foundation. A lot of doctors would provide information that brought families together, even in their worst times. So to me, that was something that I wanted to be a part of, and I found it extremely emotionally rewarding shadowing doctors that were providing that kind of care. For example, if somebody was given a bad diagnosis at a certain point in their life, it was possible for a doctor to be able to provide a certain level of support and to be able to allow that family to um, be brought together and to be able to mourn with that patient or potentially be able to push past that disease as well.